Yeah, I mean, especially anything pre-snap. I mean, that's just that's us. You know what I'm saying? That, 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 that just can't happen, especially when you're playing, you know, good teams like we're going to tonight and in the future. You know what I'm saying? That just can't happen. But, um, yeah, I mean, that, that stuff we got to get fixed and get fixed quick. You feel like uh, in a cheapy game like this, they may have kind of, kind of pushed the limit with you guys a lot of times to see how you respond? I mean, that's football. I mean, you know, it's, it, it happens it, it, at every level. Uh, you know, it's nothing we haven't seen before. Um, it's just, you know, us holding our composure. And, I mean, if we do our things right, it shouldn't even have been that situation. You know what I'm saying? We, I, I feel like we'd have been up in that game, so. Well, I mean, I think, uh, I mean, everything's a learning experience. Um, <clears throat> so, I mean, for us, it's just, you know, coming in, seeing what went wrong, tr trying to fix it and, you know, just execute better. Um, like, like he said, we have 400 yards of offense, so and that's a positive right there in itself. Um, so, I mean, we just got to keep keep going. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it's just, you know, week in week, you know, him, him being a starter, I mean, we're getting more and more reps every week of practice. So, I mean, I think it'll just keep getting better and better. The possession where you had, uh, oh, it's the, uh, the drive where you had the, the, the back to back catches to the touchdown. It's that seeing you guys are going more up tempo, obviously, playing from behind. So, you know, it's obviously not close. But is that something you can see going forward? Do you guys see the jail better when you move quicker like that? Or? Well, I mean, tempo is a part of our offense. Uh, it's, it, that was nothing. It wasn't like we changed anything we haven't been doing. Um, obviously, the play column is more aggressive when you're down, but you know, uh, tempo is what we do. So I mean, it, nothing really changed on that draft. Yeah, our, our mindset obviously is to keep playing. You know, you can't. That's not something that's completely out of that's completely out of our control. So that's not something that you can put any of your focus on. Really, you know, our job is to go out there and get stops. So to be focused on something like that is gonna, you know, kind of inhibit our play if we're out there worried about other things. So that's got to go out the mind, and you got to go on in the next play. Yeah, that happens. You know, you don't like to say that, but it definitely happens. Um, and then obviously, like Coach was saying, there's a couple times where, you know, you got to be assignment sound. You know, and we were cutting guys. There was a couple times where we cut guys loose and fit fit in the wrong gaps. And, you know, those hurt you when you're playing at this level and playing against quality opponents. So you do got to be assignment sound. Um, that's the thing with defense is you, you got to be assignment sound almost every single play because they'll, they'll bust a big one real quick. You got some more effective. Yeah, not a lot of uh, like changes on paper. Um, just you know, something that we've been working as a program for the last couple of years. You know, what we've been trying to build is uh, you know an identity. It's something that we can go out there and play for four quarters. You know, like you know, like we've talked about in the past. You know, Troy game we came out in the second half, and you know some guys just kind of folded over and you know didn't exactly finish the game. Um, and also at the same time, you know, we knew that getting a couple stops is going to give put us in the position to potentially win this game. So, you know, there was a fight to the end. Yeah, going on the road, that's not going to be easy. Um, that, that's a good football team. You know, their, their record isn't exactly indicative of who they are. They, uh, you know, they've been in a couple games. They came back, I believe, on Georgia Southern today and nearly won that game. Uh, so that's going to be an interesting game, and you know it's going to be a tough opponent. But going forward, it's the same thing. You know, come to work Monday and control what we can control. Did the game get any chippier after a quarterback was injured? Obviously, it's you know physical any time, but emotionally, especially on their side, could you tell? Maybe yeah, maybe a bit, but I mean, you can't exactly fault anybody for that. You know, we do the same if that's our quarterback. You know, it's the. the person on the team you want to protect the most and so you know the tensions may flare a little bit but you know at the end of the day you got to kind of keep your mouth shut and just play ball having Malik back how was that this week yeah it's good to have Malik back always like you said you know he's a great leader um it's nice to have somebody out there that kind of you know 
uh, Harley always tells us, you know, leaders need leaders. And that's very true because, you know, if you're out there, you kind of need somebody that can help bring bring the guys along, rally the troops. And Malik's a very good guy for that. A lot of guys look up to him. And, you know, his energy is something that, you know, I haven't seen out of a lot of people before. And I, I really enjoy playing with Malik. Um, and so having him back is big.